professional athletes often consider their team a family, and their teammates their brothers. Each player would do anything for his brother, whether it be on the field or off it. For those who are in the fight with cancer, oftentimes it takes the courage and strength of an entire family to win the battle. Tonight, we bring you the story of two amazing young men and the brothers who stepped up to help them defeat cancer. In partnership with Rady Children's Hospital San Diego, the San Diego SEALs proudly stick up for a cure. As part of this special initiative, SEALs players recently had the great honor of making two special youngsters a part of our family. First, we bring you to the story of the Pringle family, parents John and Amber, and boys Ace and Crew. He had a really, really high fever is kind of how it started. Uh, the highest that we, the reading that we got was, I believe, 106.7. They did blood work. And then that's when we found out that they are just like, get over here ASAP. Yeah, so. they're like, we have a bed ready for you yeah, immediately, immediately, you know. He actually uh, was diagnosed with MPAL leukemia, and it's pretty rare. It's a combination of AML and ALL, so he actually had both leukemias. They had a really difficult time getting them into remission. It was month after month, and you know, you're in the hospital for two weeks, then you're out for a week, and then back in, and you know, lots of different drugs, chemotherapy. Like at a point, like I couldn't really, I had no energy, mm -hmm. couldn't do anything, like I couldn't even stand up. But we finally, finally got him into remission, um, and then the doctors recommended a bone marrow transplant. Turns out that crew right over here uh, was an exact match. Yep, yeah. He got uh, crew's stem cells. He got home. Got him back into remission. Got him back into remission. And at that point, then it was like, all right, it's time to do another bone marrow transplant. The second transplant, that was it was successful. And uh, gosh, it's been about two and a half years. He's been cancer free. I feel great. Like better than ever now. And, I, and, and I was really glad to help Pace. Yeah, so you did. You were definitely part of the process of, of his cancer. Next, meet the Chapel family: parents Reef and Nicole, and brothers Reef the Third and Jimmy, who received a leukemia diagnosis of his own. Jimmy had symptoms of RSV. We thought he just had a little cold or a flu. And we went into Rady's and wound up being a lot more than that. He was basically in an induced coma for almost probably 50 to 60 days. At the beginning, I had really weird like vision. There's like a painting or a window. No, it was like calendar, that's what it was and there's 2023 glasses over it. I, I woke, cause I went to sleep November of 2022, I mean, and I woke up um, January, 2023. Wound up having to be intubated, two IVs in each arm, IVs in his stomach. At the 24th, the doctor said, we have one more treatment, we've tried everything. We have one more medicine to give him, and if this doesn't work, we're not sure. You're, this is the only time they said your son might die. And so, <laughs> of course, that hits you like a brick. It was rough. And, uh, but we got through that, got onto the oncology side. Ratings is incredible, just absolutely mind blowing. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Two of the best surgeons there. They cut them all the way down opened them up, and both doctors said they never seen anything like it. Praying for positive could keep him positive, because that's what Jimmy does. Keeps positive. The whole time, he was positive. And uh, we found out we needed a match. He needed a bone marrow transplant. Reef, his little brother, was a 10 out of 10 match, which is a really rare thing. Then Reef had to get some pretty heavy medical um, Things done and stayed in the hospital for a couple of days himself. It means to me that he calls me a superhero. <laughs> we got a tremendous amount of support, and you guys are part of the support, and we're just so grateful for you guys. Just thank you. 
Thank you. You're, you're an inspiration. Seals on three. Seals on me. One, two, three. Seals. Oh yeah, Jimmy. To defeat a foe like cancer, it takes the bravery of the afflicted and the strength of a family. Ace and Jimmy will forever be connected to their younger brothers like few in life could ever understand. While our players will always fight for their brothers on the field, the Seals and Rady Children's Hospital will fight for all those battling cancer in our community. Until there's a world without cancer, the San Diego Seals will continue to stick up for a cure. <laughs>